Dead, dead, dead also. Five. Come on. Go shot. Dead, all dead. Yo, what's up, SMS gang? It's your boy, Omar SMS. We're back with another Apex Legends video. Let, let, let me tell you guys something very quick, okay? And this video is the first gameplay. Uh, I'm playing quads, this one. It's not a win game, alright? It's not a win game. It's just video of the first game ever I played this. I want to be honest with you. It's interesting. It's, it's like so much fun. I'm not gonna lie. It's like very, very fun. But at the same time, it, it ends very quick. This is like my only issue with it. Anyway... I will not just waste your time right here talking. I know you guys are interested to improve your aim or your ADS. And at the end of the video, I put something very interesting uh, topic about uh, explaining uh, ADS tricks that I changed also to my ADS, uh, things that I want to share with you. So if you guys want that, then stay on this video, watch the video, and uh, you'll have the, these tips to help you. Yeah. If you guys enjoyed the channel, then subscribe. And if you guys want training session, then join Discord. See you guys later. Enjoy the gameplay. Cover me, cover me, cover me, cover me, cover me. Cover me. I'm here, party calls, but. Right one dead, one dead here, one dead, I'm in Chicago. One dead, one dead, one dead, one dead, one dead. We can push together. We can push together, let's go. Yes, okay, 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 cover me, cover me, cover me a little bit. I'll take it, I'll take it. Kill one guy. Let's go in. We're alive. Take the shield. 
Squad pushing me from here. He's also one though. Nice. It's one finder. Yeah. No, no, he's behind us. Dead guy, dead guy here also. Yeah, yeah, dead, dead, dead. Oh, five, 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 five. Oh, behind us, behind us, behind us, behind us, behind us. Here, here on me. Oh, shot, dead, 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 also, dead, dead. Let's go, let's go inside, let's go inside, let's go inside, let's go inside, let's go inside. Let's go inside, let's go inside. Try help, try help. Oh my god, how many? Oh, snipers! Snipers killing me. Wait, wait, zone, 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 zone. We have to push, we have to push hard. Hey, one guy. Dead, dead, dead. More people pushing, more people pushing. We have to push them hard. What the heck? Why are they all sniping? Come inside, come inside, come inside, left side, come inside. Go shot, go shot, go shot, go shot, go shot. Survive, 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 survive. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try pushing them here. One second, one second. I'm gonna try not to make them uh, make me on damage. One here, one here, one here, one shot, one shot, dead, 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 one dead, one dead. Finish him, finish him, I'll push hard. I'm with you, I'm with you, I'm with you. Wait, 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 wait. Nice. One left up, one left up. He, he fly away, he fly away. That's a lie. <laughs> oh! Okay, never mind. I'm alive, I'm alive, I'm alive, don't worry. Oh! Got drone, 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 drone. Drone here, drone here, drone, drone, drone. They push me out, they push me out, I need help. You have drone or no? Hey, hey. No, they killed one guy. One next to us. One next to us. Ah, oh, what the fuck was it? Where did you shoot me? They try, they try to push from here. We need to move. We need to move. Here, 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 drop in here. Behind you, behind you, behind you. Go shot, go shot, go shot, go shot. I'm pushed out, I'm pushed out, I'm pushed out. He's dead, 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 dead. Okay, okay, I'm pushing him out. Also here. Dead, 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 dead. Wow! Ah! I did a lot, man. Oh my god. A very common myth right now is sharing that 4-3 linear is the best sensitivity in Apex Legends because it gives you quick inbots and is the best sense overall in Apex Legends. Well, is that true or no? I'm not going to talk about 4-3 about linear right here. I'm going to talk about ADSing. What's the secret sauce of 4-3 linear compared to ADSing? Like why when you aim and shoot with 4-3 linear it feels like inbot? Yo guys, it's your boy Omar SMS. I'm back with another Apex Legends guide video. In this video, we're gonna talk about very crucial, important tips that I wanna give you right now that will help you to make your ADS feels better. What is ADS first? Let's talk about ADS. ADS is while you're aiming. So when you aim, this is ADS. When you hit fire, this is hit fire. When you're not aiming, this is hit fire. When you're aiming, this is ADS. And each one has its own accuracy, its own sensitivity, and its own feeling. So everything feels different between hip fire and ADS. Some people are good with hip fire, but they are not good with ADS. And some people are good with ADS, but they're not good with hip fire. 
Now we're not gonna talk about hip firing right now in this video. I'm gonna talk about ADSing. There's a very quick information that here I wanna give you about 4-3 linear fears. Why does 4-3 linear feel the best sense in Apex Legends? There's something that you don't understand. It's not about 4-3 linear. And it's not about being having a low sense only. There's a secret about 4-3 linear that people don't understand. And I wanna just break it out for you right now to make it in your ALC even if you use high sense. So is it possible to use high sense and have a feeling of 4-3 linear? Yes. Let's see how. So first of all, the secret sauce of 4-3 linear is let's first try to make 4-3 linear on ALCs. So the thing that you need to understand about 4-3 linear, linear is going to be very interesting. Uh, before I continue, let me just save the setting, settings here so I don't change anything. Okay. I saved my settings. Right now, it cannot be changed. So let me show you what is interesting about 4-3 linear. 4-3 linear ADS, 3 ADS in linear is going to be Right there. So it's gonna be 110 and the ADS is gonna be 60, not 65. So you can see and notice the big difference right here when you aim, alright? Okay, it's the same feeling. And now let me let me show you the 40 linear here. Here. It does feel the same feeling. It's literally the same. So what we know right now first is three ADS and linear is 110 65 pitch speed now notice this here the difference between ads yaw speed and pitch speed okay here in the ads pitch speed is so low 65 the lowest you can see on most of the alc's that you see on youtube that's the lowest thing possible most of the low sense players are using 130 125 like me, 135, 140, but the actual 40 linear is 65 ADS pitch speed. So, what's the trick here that I want to show you? The trick here that I want to show you is that the lower the pitch speed you have, the more accurate you will be. And this is something I mentioned a lot, a lot of my videos. And this is the secret sauce of 40 linear. It's not that it's low sense is that it has a very accurate pitch speed that makes you so much good when you aim and feel comfortable. I will tell you a quick reason here. Let's say I'm using linear, right? If I use linear, right? If I use linear and I have a high pitch speed, I will end up with inconsistency, inconsistency, because my up and down will be so much into raw input. This is for linear. So because of that, in 40 linear right here, which is 65 pitch speed, which is very low right here, but it's very good fast. Look here, it's fast, but here is very low. Okay, here is so fast, here is very low. Okay, this very low 65 here is what makes fourth layer special, what makes the ADS special. So, let's now try to make something very interesting. If we put a very high sense, for example, my sense, is with you like this and very low ADS pitch speed I will end up with a very good accuracy still you can see that my accuracy still feel good but what the difference here right here that I want to show you is that that the pitch speed right here will make you have more recoil because I just started it but for those people that use it for the linear and if you use high sense with 65p speed, you will still feel that you're so much accurate and your MSS is so much high. Okay? This is the secret. You can see my aim, how much it changed compared to ADSing MSS feeling. You can see like it's tracking by itself. So, this is one of the secrets. Secret sauce, you can see right here, is so much on point when I'm aiming. You can see how much is on point. So. What we understand right here is that the pitch speed plays a big part in the sense. More than having here your speed. Some people use high or low sense. I will not judge you. You can use 140. But if you keep the pitch speed low, then you will end up with a very accurate sense that even better than 40 linear. Why better? 
because you can change the small details that you cannot change in Fortnite in here. This is my ADS tip right here that I want to give you. So, lobby speed will increase the accuracy as much as you want. Will have a cost that you will have more recoil. But we don't need to care about recoil because recoil can be adjusted and learned later. For example, if you lower dead zone response curve, then your recoil will feel much less. The accuracy will feel bad if you still have high pit speed. And the proof is try it now. Put 225, for example. You can see my accuracy is off. Even though I'm using 210 before and my accuracy, my accuracy was good. Here I was using 210 and my accuracy was good. Now it feels off. Look how it's off. Why? Because the ETSP speed is very high. So decrease it. And you end up with what? More accuracy? Lo more, uh, yeah, more accuracy and more recoil. But we need to choose accuracy over recoil. Because I as I said, recoil can be adjusted and learned. Accuracy will not cannot be changed at all. So, alright, tip number two right now is not going to be about the settings at all. It's going to be about something. A tip that I want to give you, very, very important and very crucial also, right? When you're aiming and playing right now, Ava Satyans, there's something that you need to understand. All right. When you're aiming on the target, right here, the dummy, most of the people they aim on the head, they try to land their shots on the head like this, so they can make more damage. All right? This is like the most of the people they do. And this is a common mistake. This is a very common mistake. The good ADS tip that I want to give you here, instead of aiming on the head, you have to aim on the torso. And the torso is not the tummy. Some people un understand the torso is like tum tummy right here. They aim right here. Right here. Which is also not recommended. The torso is the less than the head. The less under the neck. So, we're gonna aim right here. You can see, you see this weapon that the dummy is holding? So we're gonna aim where the weapon is. Right here. On this line of the weapon. Right? And when you aim right here, you will gain the highest damage and MSS at the same time. Now, I will, I will explain to you guys why. I will explain to you guys. Now, we understand that every weapon has recoil, right? And every time you start shooting, you will have a recoil kicking in at the start, most of the time. So, because of that kick that you will have, you, need, you cannot aim on the head. If you aim on the head and you start shooting, then the kick will go above the head immediately, right here. So, you'll miss shots. You'll not be accurate. But if you aim on the torso and the ki recoil kick in, it will directly go where? To the head. It will go to the head. You see the yellow? How it's appearing while I'm aiming on the torso? So this is how it works. And when you want, want to try to push it down a little bit, it will still be on the head more on point because it cannot be pushing the analog so much that is. 100% no recoil. You'll always have recoil if you're not using Chronos or Strike Pack, okay? So, when you shoot right here, shoot on the weapon where, where the player holding the weapon. Here you gain the highest accuracy, MSS, and damage at the same time. And whether the aim goes more down or up, it will work. Now, why not aim on here, the body, right here? I will tell you why. Some people, they push the unlock too much down, okay? And when they do that, their aim will go to the legs, feet. And the feet is a very tiny place that your accuracy is going to be not on point. Your, your bullets is going to be going all out of the place. And when you aim on the head, it's the same. Some people aim go up. So what happens? They shoot the sky. So they also miss shots. So the best part is the torso on the weapon here. The two choices that will you will end up is if you go if you have the recoil went up it will go on the head and if your recoil went down it will go to here to the stomach so you'll not miss shots so this is how you gain the highest MSS possible using ADS trick aiming where the weapon is right here all right guys these are the two tips I want to give you for the best ADS possible and I don't want to jump into other details or extra informations because these are like the main information that you need to learn. And if you learn them, you'll have a very, very good ADS accuracy. And trust me, guys, if you just learn them, you'll end up with a very, very good accuracy while ADSing. So follow these tips and try to learn 
uh, I'll try to do them correctly and you'll end up with a good accuracy. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and see you later. Peace out.